full size water okay. mini public size. I think scooters are more popular today, especially if you travel in Europe. Uh, price of gas, ease of parking, plus they become very usable. Uh, they're plastic, they're lightweight, you can move them, they're easy to fix, and some are electric. It is the most comprehensive exhibit of scooters anywhere in the world. We showcase 100 different scooters from all over the globe, and we have them from the early 1900s, the beginning of scooters, all the way up to the modern Vespa. The reason we decided to do a scooter exhibit was because we're an automotive museum, and we try to tell every story we can about the automobile, but we have to tell the stories that relate to it. Motorcycles, scooters, Hollywood, all the other stories that are interesting to the automotive public and to the rest of the world. One of the earliest scooters we have in the exhibit is the 1917 Autoped, which was based off of a push scooter, uh, meaning there was no seat. They were still trying to figure out how to package the motor and the seating and all that kind of stuff. Uh, so it's kind of an interesting scooter, it folds up. Uh, we also have scooters that uh, were thrown out of airplanes with parachutes that were army scooters. We have a scooter that was um, created by Rockola, the jukebox manufacturer. Uh, we have the Mose King of the Road, which was the world's largest scooter at 13 feet long. It, it uh, seats four people. Um, we even have a car in the exhibit. We have, actually have two cars in the exhibit. One is a 1984 Honda City, and it was the only car that actually came with a scooter as an accessory. The exhibit says even if you don't care anything about motorized vehicles, you'll still have fun because you won't believe what you'll see in this exhibit. I mean, you go from these very rare scooters, you say, so what? And then you realize they built scooters to drop out of airplanes during wartime that were that big. Um, there's a scooter in there that a 14-year-old built that he put 12 kids on and drove for four hours. I mean, there's just some great stories, and it's always about story, and there's some great stories around scooters in there. Straps and stuff is tied to there's little hooks in the floor. Uh -huh. And they also. 